Jig Envy, DJ Steel, DJ Hollywood. We got our first guest in the building. Project Pat, Big Chill. What up, fellas? That's all. What's going on? Oh, man, nothing, man. You know, just flew out. Just, uh, they, they just they parachuted me into New York. Okay. Yeah, they parachuted me in, and uh, I landed all right. And so, you know, I had to stop my off <laughs> and give me something to eat. Uh, what was that spot we went to? Uh, black, uh, where we ate? Amy yeah. Roofs. Amy Roofs. Amy Roofs, okay. Salute to the Roofs, man. Yeah, they're good food, man. What? I got some over there. Amazing Big food. Oh, you, you took some with you. I bought another plate. Damn it, man. <laughs> so what's been going on, Project Pack? Man, nothing, man. Look, I got this uh, 30 record I'm pushing uh, featuring Young M.A., uh, Big Trill, Coco Van Gogh. Uh, my little young guy out of, uh, out of Atlanta. And, man, you know, just a hand in the cookie jar just trying to get a bag, you know, some mm-hmm. money, man, you know. Trying to get some of the ice you get on your wrist over there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Saucing and bossing. <laughs> yeah, you sauced up on no, I'm working. I'm sitting there working, man. Now, let's talk about what you've been up to, man. We haven't seen you for a long time, but you still got longevity in the game. Man, I just been uh, dropping some mixtapes. I just dropped um, a Street God. Uh, I've been. I just got a series of mixtapes. I like got one series called Street God. Street God One, Street God Two, Street God Three. I'm finna drop Street God Four. Mm-hmm. Uh, we, just, we just dropped a project today. Me and Big Trill called uh, Real G's Make G's. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying uh, on that piff and uh, man, you know, just staying out there. You know, you just gotta. You know, as far as the longevity situation, man. I'm first and foremost. I'm just blessed. You've been in the game over 20 years, man. Yeah. You don't put me out there like that. <laughs> but but, <laughs> but consistent, you. though. You know what I mean? I mean, uh, I'm good. Watching I'm your good. albums and your covers, I remember, you know, and, and there's no disrespect, but that's when the covers look bootleg. Yeah. And they, they look absolutely positively yeah. fake. But, yeah. But they were moving units. And, yeah. you know, you guys were pretty much independent for a long time. Uh-huh. And so, so how do you, you know, change from I mean, 2000, 2001 to, to now, where it's no longer really mixtapes or CDs, it's USB drives and even. Yeah. Emails and, and scanning. Well, you gotta, you gotta first and foremost, when you dealing with music, you gotta deal with the younger producers, right? To catch the younger ears, absolutely. Then you gotta mix and mingle with the younger artists. You know what I'm saying? And you know, if anybody knows me, you know, if you, anybody was to Google my uh, interviews in the past and present, I, I always stick to my first mind. And my first mind is, you know, I'm black Jewish. Mm-hmm. I'm a numbers man. Mm-hmm. So it's, it's all about money. You know what I'm saying? I mean, don't get it twisted. I mean, you know, I love what I do because, you know, I mean, like you said, the longevity in it. I ain't, I ain't got to worry about the looking in the rearview mirror with the feds and the robbers and all that, you know, but you, know, you got to watch the robbers. But, Absolutely, all the yeah. time. <laughs> but you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, I mean, man, I'm just, just out here just, 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 man, just, I'm just blessed to be still in it and to be making a check off of it. Right. You know what I'm saying? And for the people who don't know who you are, how did you get into the game originally? Originally, I'm be honest with you, I really wasn't into rapping like that. My brother's Juicy J, he's a producer. So he was into it. Right. So he told me, he said, he's always telling me, like, one day, okay, one day we was North Memphis uh, in Projects, uh, Cypress God. Uh, I was riding my brother around. He said, man, come go with me, drop these uh, CDs, well, tapes was out at the time. Tapes, right. Uh, 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 at stereo stores. So I said, okay, cool. So we went to all these stereo stores. He was dropping them off. And man, all of a sudden I looked up, the money he was counting was like over $24,000. Damn. In a day. And I said, hey, man. <laughs> it said it like this And he was like Yeah that's what I'm trying to tell you Man you need to start rapping I, I'm rapping I'm rapping You just make key money In a day I right. said And I mean it was like We like four drops And you made tw- over 24,000 So I was just like Man you know I'm in the wrong business You know what I'm saying mm-hmm. I need to get in what you in You know what I'm saying At least on the side or something Right So you know That's how. I, that's really how I got in the game My, bro- my brother was the one the, the name Project Peck Came from the street It was a street name Right 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 Okay my brother's the one who pushed me, motivated me. Man, you got to do this. You got to rap like this. You got to come different. You got to find you a niche, a style. And, like, that's what made me do what I do. That's why I came with the patar and all that, because he pushed me into right. it. Mm-hmm. Right, right, right. Now, with, with, with everything going on in Memphis now and everything, is, is it a unity in the city? As far as who? Like the people? Yeah. With the you know, the like, artists, the artists. Oh, the artists. Oh, I thought you meant, like, with the Black Lives Matter. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. We ain't do the Black Lives Matter now. Okay, Not okay, yet. Okay. okay. Uh... <laughs> Uh, I mean, it is, uh, you know, a lot of people do their own thing. Memphis got a lot of leaders, you know what I'm saying? A lot right. of dudes, you know, more, it's more chiefs than Indians, so, you know. And, and you know. It seems divided a little bit. No, I'm going to be honest with you. Me, personally, all the young dudes, I mess with them all. Even right. the dudes that ain't heard, that you ain't heard of, that's coming up. Mm-hmm. Because, see, like, they, they, they gravitate and, you know, they, they rap about what's going on. And, you know, they from where I'm from and, like, you know, like you got your, you got Dolph, you got Black Youngs out here, you know, and you got uh, 
uh, Don Tripp and uh, uh, Gotti. yeah, yeah. But not, I'm saying like the younger artists though, like okay. like like uh, uh, um, Moneybag Yo. Gotcha. Like you know, like dudes like that, like they, you know, you got you got uh, artists I'm working with right now, King Ray. You know what I'm saying? It's like these the dudes, the younger cats. These dudes is like. Like keep me alive, right? So you no know, long as they own, I'm on. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? So I, I mean, you know, if on my tip, on you asking me personally, I, I mess with all of them. You know what okay. I'm saying? It's, I'm good with it. Nah, nah. I mean, I just love the energy. Like I love the energy of Young Dolph and, and what he's doing. I love Black Youngster. He just actually hit me like ten minutes ago. We just changed his number. Like I love the feeling and the energy. Mm-hmm. But it just seems like nobody. Like I, I would love to see every all the artists in Memphis do something together. But it, it would be good. I, you know, I, I don't know if I ever see that. Hopefully it will, it will happen. And you know what? I'm be honest with you, man. It, it, it really should because you know we as a people, period. That's how we get you know divide and conquer. That's how right. we messed off anyway. You right, know right. what I'm saying? So you know, I mean, it would be nice. It really would. Right now, what, what's going on with you, Trail? Hey man, blessed man. Trying to keep the belly on full, working. How would you go with Project Pat? Oh, this is my guy right here, man. We've been working for like two years. Um. You know, well, we met in Memphis at a video shoot, right? Mm-hmm. We, 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 yeah, and then we, 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 we still didn't know each other. Okay. You know, me and him got it. It's, it's, it's real crazy. Mm-hmm. We met at a video video shoot. We still didn't know each other. What you mean? <laughs> I, I, I didn't know him We were standoffish I was like Okay let's do the video See that's yeah. the whole Memphis thing You on one side I'm on one side What up son Let's just keep moving right So why did y'all Start working with each other Man Money, money. I don't know Money it's like, it's like We was at odds With each other mm-hmm. Like Okay Like It's like this Like he he, he 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 was doing his thing With making some money Industry wise I was doing mine And we would always Bump heads Right So we would bump heads So much on the internet Like with Look, I, like so, like you know, dudes trying to get this and get that, and it's like, okay, well, look, I, I'm doing this, I'm doing this, so we would bump heads. And I said, man, I, I, I said, man, let me, I said, this dude, he's so, he's so on it. Mm-hmm. Let me just hook up with this dude and make some money with him, cause right, right. I, I can't, I, I can't beat this dude. Right, you know right. what I'm saying? And so that's how we just like, and then once we, once we kind of like uh, took our masks off. And seeing who we each other really was, and he was like, "Oh, okay, you buy some money, I'm buy some money. Yeah, let's let's do it." So that's what happened. Mm. You are tuned in to Hip Hop Nation. It's DJ MB Susan at live. Chill mm. Project Pat's in the building. Study, 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 study. Now y'all got an album out right now. What do y'all call it? Album, mixtape, EP? What do y'all call it? Real G's make G's. Real G's make G's. They can pick it up right now. How can they get it if they need to get it? Uh, right now it's on that path, man. It's uh. And who we got on it? We got Rick Ross, Rich the Kid, mm-hmm. um, Salsa Man, um, Fat Trail, Vado. You know, we working, baby. Now, of, of course, people also associate you with Three Six Mafia. Of course. Now, is there ever gonna be a, another Three Six Mafia album? Is that gonna happen? You no, know, you know, we, we you might have to put we, your brother in the headlock and be like, "Come on over here." No, no, no headlock. <laughs> <laughs> now we was in the um, we in the um, uh, makes of it. Um, to be honestly. Uh, it's kind of like getting discussed now. Seriously, mm-hmm. it's not. Uh, it, 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 it was. It was. It was a, a, a full goal at one point, and like a month ago. But then it, some had to be worked out about some. But it's it's in it's up in the air. Okay. Yeah, but it's up in the air strongly. That's like, that's like a good strong, thing. You know. <laughs> now, because I know everybody was doing their own thing, so it's hard when everybody's making money doing their own thing to come back together as a group and say we're gonna do this for the culture or do this for our fans. So that's always the most difficult thing. Yeah, well. No, it was the check got to get right. That's all. Really. <laughs> yeah. But I mean, I'm 100% for it. You right, know what right, I'm right. Of course, but, you know. So what's next for you guys? What's what's next on the horizon? Man, um, well, uh, we sh- we shot uh, we shot uh, my- our part to the video. Uh, we shooting Young and May uh, tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we so shooting her tomorrow. How'd you, how'd you hook up with Young and May? I, I-, I hooked up to it with her through Trill. Uh, mm-hmm. Trill, but like right before she was popping, popping, popping. Uh, he had introduced me to. He's like, man, check this girl out. Da, 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 da. And I was curious to see, like, like you know, because you guys have a lot of young artists on, on your album, and, and you say Young and May. How did you hear the, hear Young and May before everybody else did? Uh, he well, man, he, I, he did. He heard her, mm-hmm. and then he let me hear her. And the thing about why I liked it, it of course, she's spitting straight flame, right? But it's like I tried to do that with a girl before, and it just didn't turn out right because the girl I was messing with was too street, right? But like when I synced it, I I, I know that vision. Right. I know that I know I, I know it's gonna go. You know what I'm saying? So I just was like when I heard her spit, I said, "Whoo." 
man I said oh yeah she the truth mm. so you know <laughs> then um, he like I said he was do, when he was due to me or whatever this was like right before the ooh the ooh yeah it was right before it and then like when he had caught <clears throat> he, he hit me up one day he's like look man you hear that and I was like yeah I see that I see that and then bam there the went. Yeah. Now, what, now what put you on a young M.A.? Shit I met her at a uh, I work with Slay mm-hmm. On Wednesday nights And shit I met her And I'm like man We gotta get you with Pat We gotta knock this shit out and, mm-hmm. Man It's a blessing man And the rest was history That's it mm-hmm. Alright now the album You can pick it up right now It's on that Piff It's on a, a bunch of other sites Definitely anyway. pick that up I look forward to hearing more music from y'all. And Pat, you better come up to New York a lot more, man. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, indeed. The funny thing is I never really check my DMs, right? And then I see uh, something from Pat that says, check your DM. I'm like, Pat? (laughs) I'm like, this nigga Pat can get my number from anywhere. Let me see if that's really him. He's like, I'm going to come into town. I'm going to play. I need to stop through. I said, whatever you need, boy. Dig that. Hip Hop Nation. Project Pat's in the building. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Big chill in the building. Sauce and Bowson. Coco Bango. Now, he was singing on the hook. Yes. What, Coco, what's his name? Coco Bango. Coco Bango. All right. Now, now. so what's next for the project? going to do another project together. What y'all, what's next now for the people out there? And how can people get in contact if they need to? Want to follow you on Instagram, Twitter, all that good stuff. All right. Well, you know, what's next is, uh, like I said, we dropped the real G's, make G's. I'm going <laughs> to drop this uh, Scree God 4, uh, Tried and True. Uh, my IG is Real Project Pat Real Project Pat And uh, I mean You know man We just We just out here working man You know what I'm saying I'm pretty sure Coco got something for the, he, just, he got something That just dropped What Coco. you got Coco? Yeah I just dropped A project called um, Cocaine Flow mm-hmm. And I got Pat on it mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying Going crazy right now And uh That's what's going on I'm just pushing my project Right now Okay Now, now do you still get excited To make music? Cause you've been doing it for a while. Do you still have the same excitement when when you first did it? Okay, okay. You want me to tell you a story or a lie or the truth? <laughs> All of the above. All not, of the above. Not, not the truth. The truth, of course. I mean, I do. I'm gonna tell you something. I do when I feel the beat. You know okay. what I'm saying? If I feel the beat, I'm like, man, it's fire. Like, woo. <laughs> but it, I can rap. You know, if I don't really feel the beat like that, I can rap. But you know, like, hey man, I, I've been in a situation where I wasn't feeling the beat, rap, and that was the one. You know right, what I'm right, saying? Right, right, right. You know, because I'm not good. I'm not a producer. Like, my brother, he's pretty good at, man, that's it, that's it, that's it. But me, I, I'm i just... You just go in there and rap. I'm just like that... I'm like the definition of that big black dumb rapper. Okay. I just, go, <laughs> just go in there and do it. Just, all right, man. Y'all do what y'all want to do with that. Okay. We good? Okay, I got to go. You know, but I mean... Are you in the studio a lot? You record a lot? I do. I do, but when I do record, like, I'm the type of person that I write, like... Like you know, that person they cook it up. I write it up, mm-hmm. and then I go in and lay like fifteen songs. Right. Like in, in, in one night, I lay fifteen, bam, whole songs. Then I'm like, bam. Then I go back and listen to them, and clean them up. You know, change this, that, change the verse, do that. Do, you know. Gotcha. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's well, mainly how I work. And like freestyles, I'm not good at freestyles. Mm-hmm. Like, like a, I'm, 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 I'm like a good basketball player that's not good at free throws. Okay, Shaq. you should kill O'Neal. Yeah, 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 yeah. You Shaq. Yeah, she is Shaq. Hey, man. Yeah, yeah. Dunk all day, but we put him on the line. Uh, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Well, I appreciate you guys joining me again. Make sure you pick up the album, the album mixtape EP, whatever you want to call it. Real G's, real G's, make G's on uh, that piff right now, and uh, Street God Four coming out, and uh, Coco Van Gogh got a joint right now that's out on that piff. Okay, that's murder hard. That's on murder hard. All right. Well, we appreciate you guys for joining us. It's DJ every Tuesday night live. Let's go. Hip hop hits, period. Serious XM Hip Hop Nation.